Good evening traders, welcome to 200forexpips.com. Okay traders, uh, in this video I am going to talk about the settings for the cent account as well as for the mini account. So guys, uh, basically when you will buy this EA, I will send you this file and you will copy that file and then you will go to uh, file section here on your MetaTrader 4 and then you will go to open data folder. Okay, just a second open data folder and then you will go to mql4 and then you will go to experts and then you will paste that one here okay you can see it's already uh, opened at my side and guys uh, once you paste this file here then you come to uh, the expert and then it's better to restart your mt4 terminal once you restart your M mt4 terminal then go to the navigator and in, uh, in experts just uh, right click here and then refresh it and once you refresh it, then you can see uh, there is uh, the EA that will say that uh, that's, it's ready to work on that one. But setting is very important. So guys, first of all, please make sure that you will use this EA on Euro USD and Euro Canadian dollar only. So uh, you can see that currently my trades are on on Euro USD and Euro uh, Euro USD and Euro Canadian dollar. So I'm just going to give you the setting on Great Britain Pound USD, but you will not trade any uh, anything on Great Britain Pound USD. It's just for the setting purpose that what setting you need to do on uh, by using this EA. So when you will double click that EA, uh, first of all make sure that auto trading should be on. Let me show you here that this if you will click on this one, it will turn red, but it should be green in that color. So if your auto trading is turned off, then you make sure that your auto trading should be on. Okay, now when you double click that one, now you need to hear, do some setting. So guys, first of all, I am going to recommend this one. Uh, that first of all, uh, when you are using this EA, do not go directly to the mini account. Because I have seen it's taking too many trades on the cent account. So first of all, try with the cent account. So what to do here? Uh, so with the lower lot size is 0 0.30. So your investment will be safe with this lot size. Uh, so set up the lot size 0 0.30 you can set up the higher lot size later but for the initial setup you should lot size 0 0.30 and lot exponent to 1.11 okay and the next step is the pip setup you will change the pip setup from 180 to 150 so we have changed three things till now and the fourth thing that you will change is the maximum lot size so maximum lot size is 0 0.50 and the top take profit you will set up is for 25 so guys basically you will do setting on these four to five that what i have explained till now so first of all and let me repeat it again the lots 0 0.3 1.11 is the lot exponent pip set up 150 and maximum lot 0 0.5 and then take profit 25 and then you will press ok and when you will press ok then these trades will be executed from your side so guys uh, this is the setting that you need, need to know and make sure that the smiley should be on you can when this smiley will turn off if you close the auto trading now you can see it's not smiling here so when you make the auto trading on now you can see it's working again so guys uh, i'm testing it on a smaller account so that it's best that when some EA works on a smaller account, so it means that it's a very good EA. So right now, uh, if I show you here, uh, I have talked about the in my previous analysis. So let me drag it down. Okay. So you let this is a real account. First of all, let me t t show you here. This is a real account. This is not a demo account, and you can check the results here today. Okay. Five point seven five seven point five zero twenty five minus, and then but overall it's going in a very good profit till now so if you look at here the maximum trades are in profit so that's why i say that first of all you should try it on a cent account because it's taking so many uh, trades on a cent account so once and when this is for the uh, you can say that this is for the newcomers also who are just uh, new to the trading market they do not lose their money they should take the minimum risk in this market and this is how the minimum risk is taken till now now you can see that's 22 is this uh, uh, is the loss going on here but later it will adjust the trades according to it and once it comes into the profit it automatically closes that uh, trades and the bundle of trades and then it will take new trades and one more thing about this ea guys let's say uh, if all of the trades are closed on profit and 
there is no trade executed here but let's say uh, that you uh, you have waited for a long time but no trade is executing then you should close that chart and then reopen the chart and do this setting again that my, what i have explained till now on euro usd and the same setting will stay on euro canadian dollar and then you will do it and then again the trades will be triggered so guys just make sure you should use this ea wisely i uh, as per my experience and what i have shown in my youtube videos till now this uh, expert advisor is in testing phase and it's giving very good results till now so overall it's uh, very successful so i will post the further results also so let's say let's see how it goes further so this is the method of installation and the guide that i have provided you first go with the sent account and yes uh, one thing uh, more that let me show you that the how what to do when you are using the mini account you just need to one thing for a mini account so it will take less trades as i have experienced in the demo account so 0 0.01 is the lot size 0 0.1.11 is the uh, lot exponent and pip set up 150 uh, sorry 150 and the maximum lot you will set up it to 0 0.50 and the take profit again uh, that will be the uh, 25 so the only thing that is changed is the lot size that we have changed that it will keep to 0 0.01 and when you will press ok then it will trade the trades uh, to trigger the trades moreover guys also look at the common and make sure that your live trading allow live trading should be ticked on and then you press ok if it is not tricked on then it will not take any kind of trade so guys best of luck and i have told you uh, the setting if you will have any questions then please write to me on info at the rate of 200 forexpips.com Okay guys, thank you so much. Have a good day.